doing group videos, girl. She talking. Yeah. 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 Oh. I teach you what works. So this is what I did to get banned. My philosophy is this. If something works, don't stop doing it. Double up on that shit. If something works, don't stop doing it. Double up on it. Just like you rolling dice and shit. Double up, nigga. Right? So I get a Google, I get a Google my business profile, right? Boom, I'm, I'm getting phone calls. I'm like, oh shit, this shit is kind of lit. I'm getting the phone calls. I already know sales, right? I already know sales, so I know I could close the deals. I was like, so what I need to do now, I need to increase my traffic. If I increase my traffic and the volume of calls that are coming in, I can close more deals, right? So I'm like, nigga, it's time to double up. Roll them dice. So now, instead of having one Google My Business, nigga, I had 70. Yes, yes, indeed. Now, I told, I tell my students, I did this, and this is what got me banned from Google. Because I'm like, wait a minute. If, if I get 10 calls a week from one Google My Business listing, then if I create another listing, I should get 20 calls per week. If I create three listings, I should get 30 calls per week. And I just kept going and going and going and going and going until I had 70. How did I get 70, you ask? Well, whenever I would do an assignment, let's, I'm in Chicago right now. But if let's say I did an assignment in New Jersey. And I contracted a, a notary out in New Jersey. I would be like, hey, it was a pleasure doing business with you. A lot of times the notaries would say, man, this is great. I didn't have to wait four weeks for my payment. Uh, can I? <laughs> how can I be a part of your team? How can I join your team? I'd be like, not a problem. Let me show you how you do that. I, I created a landing page to get all their information. And then I, told, I tell them on the phone, I said, we are going to send a postcard to your home. It's going to be coming from Google. I need you to send me back those five digit code that they send you on the postcard. Now, at the time, Google will allow you to send two postcards per home. So I would send two postcards to every single notary I did business with, not only the notaries, but I did it with my friends and family. I did it with cousins. I did it with shit. I'd be even paid people. Let me send a postcard to your house so I can show people that I'm running a business in that neck of the woods. And it blossomed into 70 listings. Now, if I'm getting, now I want you to do the math. See, this is the shit that they don't teach you, these crab mother. So do the math. If I'm doing 10 phone calls per, per listing, how many do you think I'm getting at 70? And by the way, guys, you guys could put a chat, you know, talk in the chat if you like. I'll say what's up to you guys, give you guys some shout outs. So at that point, my phone is ringing off the fucking hook. I mean, from, from early day to, to late night, it's just off the chain. It got to the point where I literally had to hire a full-time employee from the Philippines to help with all of the goddamn phone calls that were coming in. It was overwhelming. It was overwhelming because then I could, it was, it was procedure, procedure, procedure. And I had systems, but it was, it was a lot. It was a lot. Now I had to get a call system. I had to get ring central in order for my uh, executive assistant to answer the phone calls from the Philippines. It was a lot of shit, but it was new problems, right? With new problems. Whenever you solve, anytime you solve a problem, 10 new problems will show up. Anytime you solve one problem, 10 new problems will show up. I'll give you an example. And Myron Golden uses this very, very well. He says, you buy an iPhone, right? And that iPhone or any phone, even an Android phone, I'm an Android, I'm a droid. Um, 
once you buy that phone, which is the average cost of a phone is about six, six to seven hundred dollars minimum, and then it goes up from there, right? What what do you buy next after you buy that phone? 